Jim, you should have listened to me. I told you, you should be prepared. You can't do these activities without any protection. I know you. Even kicking around a soccer ball is dangerous for you. When both people are ready, both consent, and there is good communication about protection, sex can and should feel really good, both physically and emotionally. But sex can also bring concern and worry. Unprotected sex can lead to unplanned pregnancy or STDs, including HIV. Sometimes people don't use protection. Maybe they were using drugs or drinking and didn't think about it. Sometimes the people using contraception make a mistake and it doesn't work correctly. Perhaps the person was sexually assaulted. There are some things that a person can do after they have had sex and either didn't use protection or the protection didn't work. Emergency contraception is also called the morning after pill, Plan B, or Ella. Is a pill that you can get from a family planning clinic or be bought in a drugstore or pharmacy. Emergency contraception can help prevent pregnancy when taken up to five days after unprotected sex or birth control failure. The sooner it's taken, the better it works to prevent pregnancy. Another option is that a healthcare provider can insert an IUD after unprotected sex to help prevent unwanted pregnancy. But neither prevents STDs or HIV. PEP, or post-exposure prophylaxis, is a medication that can be used in an emergency if a person has been exposed to HIV. PEP must be started within 72 hours after unprotected sex. PEP can be hard to get, but should be available from a healthcare provider like your doctor, a family planning clinic, or the emergency room of a hospital. A week or two after unprotected sex, or if your period is late more than a week after unprotected sex, you can take a home pregnancy test. If the test is positive, it's important to talk to your partner and or a trusted adult in your life as there are some big decisions to make. If the pregnancy test is negative, it's also important to talk to your partner about ways to avoid getting into this situation again. Going to a family planning clinic can help you and your partner hmm. figure out some possible next steps. Just make sure to go to a clinic that has actual nurses and doctors working there since some clinics that advertise free pregnancy tests and consultations don't tell you honestly about all of your options. Using contraception and condoms every time you have sex is the best way to protect yourself and your partner against unplanned pregnancy and STDs, including HIV. It was horrible, I tell you. Balls were flying everywhere. I'm never, ever going back there again. Until next time. Don't forget to visit me at amaze.org or go to my YouTube channel to watch more. Bye!